Hello and welcome back to City Skylines. I made a small error. I didn't hit record. So I've recorded about 10 minutes in the future. So you missed some building, which is unfortunate, but it means I get to unveil something to you. Over here we have the rich part of town. So we have a ton of like big things with Expo Center, with the Mall of Moderation, with hospitals. Basically, this area has everything. It has everything you possibly need. It has uh, that's bus lanes everywhere. In fact, I didn't put any bus routes in, so that's something we need to do. It has car parks, it has like shopping areas, it has its own police station, so fire station. It has high schools, it has elementary schools. It, it is basically just, you know, it, over here, this is hell. This is the nice, this is the place you want to live. So you were over here, this is like, this is the place you always want to move to. Oh, now that I think about it, I was doing some zoning things here, which is when I noticed that uh, I wasn't connected. Uh, so basically we have some zoning issues along the edge because I just kind of used bound zoning. But what I've just realized is I didn't put in any leisure areas, which just seems very foolish. So let's get rid of, say, a little bit of this. Um, although leisure is just high, actually, never mind, we'll put that back in. Leisure, leisure is just this, but like a zone, isn't it? So if I go in here and I just go, uh, maybe a smaller zone. I just say like this area is going to quickly designate as leisure. Nice. So this is just a nice place for people to live. Uh, do you want to put in like a large zone over the top of this as well? Uh, maybe. Nice if you could have sub zones. I don't believe that you can, but if you could have like a sub zone, like here's this area, and this sub zone is then all about leisure. But you can't really do that in the way that I want it to be done. But yeah, it has parks everywhere. It's gonna look nice when it's done. Oh, this little uh, what's that? That's a drugstore, which for some reason decided to build itself over here. Where there was no electricity in at the start. Not ideal. Not ideal. Uh, we'll just go along here and get this electricity. There we go. We'll, pl we'll plug it in. There we go. Nice. So hopefully everything's going to start building over here. Everything's going to be fantastic. And again, apologies. I did not record that. But, you know. These things happen. Uh, our water's looking pretty good. Our electricity... Very, very good. Yeah, we're in, we're in a good spot. Oh, did we finish emptying this? Emptying, finishing. Finished. Nice. We can destroy that bit. We can tell the next building to empty over here. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, We empty this one. We empty this one. Nice. Get rid of that one. I think I said I was going to put an incineration plant down every time I got rid of one. So, you know, there we go. Incinerate. Well, there's one incineration plant. And then over here, I guess we need another one. There we go. That's fine. That'll work. That'll work. A couple of incineration plants now. Uh, that electricity thing says it's not connected to anything. It isn't. That is correct. Now we have more electricity because that's connected into the grid. Nice. Uh, everything's looking great. This tower. I did record this bit, didn't I? I? I really don't know how much I didn't record. I feel really bad about that, actually. But, you know. Whatever. Uh, over here, this is looking good. People aren't really moving in at the speed I was hoping they'd move in at, but it's a nice area. Basically, I'm just hoping that the niceness of the area is going to get a ton of people moving in here over time. We'll see, though. We still have people moving out of our city, which is, like, not ideal. Is there anything else I can put over here to get people moving in? I don't know. Oh, bus route. Bus route is something I want to do. So we're going to put in a little bus uh, depot next to the uh, mall of moderation. There we go. Then we're going to put... That's a taxi one I just put down, isn't it? It is a taxi one I just put down. Well, I suppose that's not too bad. We'll put in a taxi stand over uh, here. There we go. Uh, but I wanted to put in buses. So we're going to put in a bus... Because it's bus lane, the whole... Like, the whole area is bus lane. So we'll put that in there. And then we'll just put in... Not bus stations, bus stops everywhere. So... Uh, one X, One there there this stop's gonna be like the major like site stop it's just gonna loop all the way around there complete and then this one's gonna be the like interior so it's just gonna go around the edges there we go 
and it's just going to cover all the little bits that nobody, nowhere else is going to cover. So maybe something like that, something like that, something like that, something like that. Uh, where did I start? I started over here. So we'll go in, in like this, in like that, around here, around there, complete line. Nice. So we have a few bus routes going around there, which should be quite nice and get people uh, going. Uh, why did that car go down this route? I can't figure out a reason why it would, unless this route is somehow quicker than going like just around the corner. Maybe. I don't know. Oh god, they all need water. What's wrong with the water? We are out of water. Uh, water pumping stations are out of electricity. Why are they out of electricity? Because our electricity is low. So we're not out of water, we're out of electricity. Um, which we had so much of, which suddenly disappeared. Where did our link go? Well, it's not linked up. Can't figure it out. Where did all... Maybe the wind went down or something? It's possible. Um, I don't know. What happened to all of our electricity? Uh, we could put more coal power. We could go for one of these. It'd give us about another hundred, maybe. Costs a lot, but that is a. V it must be placed next to a roadside as well. Oh, so it needs to be like over here. Maybe we could have this this area over here, in on top of everything else, its own solar power generation. Just to be like, here's another thing that this area has that nothing else does. Yeah, we'll put that over there. Um, then we'll also chuck in some. Some coal power plants along here. Just to be certain that we're not running out of things. Like, not running out of electricity. Um. Slope too steep. Pretty much all the way along there. Yeah, and then. Just to continue adding into things. Uh. We can get five out of that. That's not too good. Get more of these. We can get up to like seven, eight. We'll get some, some more, more of these at seven. Uh, six. Do we have any other areas that'd be good for that? Like up here, we can get like up to eight. So let's just go for some of that. There we are. Something like that, and then we'll just connect that into the grid. And we'll do multiple connections into the grid so it doesn't fail. Right, there we go. Our electricity is back up, which means that our water should be back up. Nice. We're now well over the amount we need for electricity as well, which is really where we want to be. We always want to be well over. Okay. Uh, that needs water? Oh. Yeah, there is no water there. You're right. Okay. That's fine. Oh, it's out of city limits to go that far? Yep. The, the other ta the other city's really complaining that I'm building a nice water supply to them. Okay. Nice. This little utopia over here is looking quite good. Lot of buildings. Uh, do we have any office buildings? Yeah, we have a few office buildings kind of going up here and there. That's fine. How's our uh, education going? We have a lot of people eligible for, for that now. University, we have a l more eligible than capacity. Like, we have more than enough capacity as well there. That's nice. Cool. Everyone should be relatively happy. We're not making quite as much as we were, but that's nice. Uh, can we pay off our loans? Yeah, we can pay off both of our loans, which is nice. That gets, makes it means that we earn more money. I mean, it doesn't really change anything because you, you don't get interest for, like you don't get interest off of paying them early here. But that's fine. Uh, do you want to like lower taxes or raise taxes or something? Probably not. No. Um, everything seems fine for just now. Uh, yeah. Are people using taxis and things? 14 people are using the taxis. 600 are using the buses. What was the other one that we had there? Uh, in our budget. We had one other. Trains. Oh, well, we're using cargo for the trains. So it doesn't really count under the same thing, does it? Because it's not, like, citizens. It's, like, um, it's cargo. So it means that, um, it's lowering the amount of other types of traffic that we get. Just fine. How are we doing on bins? We got bin capacity? 
we have bin capacity by a lot. Okay, cool. Uh, anything else emptying? Not really. How are we doing at the football? We won three games in a row. That is real good. We can start pushing up. We can say uh, we can make public transport free on match days. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's do that. Um, why does it say one times? We're putting on one bus, maybe? Match security costs 500 per week per stadium. Yeah, sure. And then this one costs 9,000 per week multiplied by the number of stadiums in the city. So it costs us 9,000 per week. Uh, not too worried about that. Not too worried about that. That's fine. Uh, do we want to raise ticket prices? Not really. Disconnected power grids, it said. Do we? I don't see any disconnected power grids, but I wouldn't put it past me to have disconnected. There we go. Nice. So that's that hospital connected up. And that explains why we had so much, why we had health problems down there. It's because that hospital wasn't connected up to electricity, so it wasn't actually producing any health. Nice. Uh, everywhere seems to be going fine. Over here. What are you thinking? You're good. Oh, they were saying they were flooded. Uh, yeah, they did get kind of flooded there, didn't they? Uh, yeah, I kind of want to lower the ground over here. Oh, no. Let's lower brush strength by a lot. It's like clicking and then it instantly goes down. Okay. Well, let's, let's do something like this. It's going to look awful. But hopefully... This kind of works. Um, yeah, nice beachfront properties. It, it, it looks, it looks, it looks glorious, right? Just the kind of place you'd want to live. Ugh. Can't say that that's quite, I don't really like this new landscaping one. Sand, new. Level terrain. Uh, that's not quite what. Uh, uh, oh. Okay. You know what? I think I'm going to stop while the going's good. We fixed the problem. <laughs> we have made a death canyon, but we have fixed the problem. This landscaping tool might allow us water. That might be a way to fix it. What we got? Water? I don't want these. I just want... I want to drop water in at it. No, it's not okay with that. It's okay. Uh, let's see what we got. Sloped, sloped terrain. Oh, no. It appears every type of terrain is actually just... Uh, I'll just push it straight down into the ground. So that's fine. Um, click the second button. So click first one to choose it and then... or. Uh, soften terrain. It looks kinda exactly the same as everything else, unless I've got this wrong. Yeah, this looks exactly the same as everything else that's been happening. You know what? It's good. It adds character, it adds flavor. <laughs> like, just outside city limits, the other, the other group must be like, what has happened to our river? Okay, um... Then over here, it's just dried out completely. Does this mean we have no... <laughs> We've just actually removed a river from over here. Okay. Made a lake, removed a river. Alright, cool. This, this is less of a utopia now. How are people thinking? Uh, everyone liking over here? Seems to be. Uh, no, that was, uh, I want, that was... I want to build here. Oh, wait. No, I can't build here. I'm going to fall off the edge. <laughs> Let's just dezone these areas. <laughs> uh, okay. Yep. Okay. Well, the joys of using mods, huh? Let's let's zone a very specific corner of this area. There you go. Right. Well, I should have learned after this mishap, which actually doesn't look that bad now compared to whatever this is. Is this filling up with water? 
It's kind of filling up with water and then it gets to this point where it's not at, where it's too far down to fill up. Ah. Oh. Okay. Does this mean this is going to fill all the way up and then kind of go over the top over time? That'd be cool. I think that might actually be what it's going to do. It's going to fill all the way up and then it's going to kind of tip over the top. You know what we could do? Now, this, this, is, this is... We're getting into risky territory here, right? But what we could do is we... We could go further. We could go deeper. Oh, now it works like I expect it to, by the way. Now, now it's like, oh, I'm just going to put in a little bit of a dip. Okay, over here. How's it looking now? No, it still looks like I'm just kind of, you know, destroying the landscape. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to make it so that it will actually go all the way to the coast. Is that fine? That work? I have no idea if this has worked or not because it's dark. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and say that this probably didn't work as rivers probably don't go uphill. But you know, whatever, close enough. Oh, everyone's really happy at something that just happened over. Oh, did the football win? Uh, looks like we did just win a football game, yes. And dead are waiting to be picked up. What the hell happened at the football game? That's, that's a... <laughs> like, I've heard of teams murdering other te like, teams, but I don't think anyone really meant it literally. Go pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, straight away. Ooh, we got a dead person picked up. Nope, dead person's not getting picked up. Uh, Hearst should be picking up people here, right? Alright, we need some more death care, I guess. This is now a nice death care area. Okay, there we go. I don't want our stadium to get destroyed. Can someone please pick up the dead person? Can somebody please pick up the dead person from here? Look at the number of hearses going past and no one's like, oh, I could, I could pick them up. Anybody? Pick up a dead person from the foggy residence. Okay. How about pick up a dead person from the stadium? Anybody? Nope. Looks like we're going to lose our stadium. Which is pretty, uh, pretty cool. Where are you on? Football stadium. Nice. We got first. Like, that worked, right? That worked. Yeah, well, no, but there's more than one dead person at the football stadium. Again, what happened here? So he picked up another one. There is at least two dead at the football stadium. Okay. Oh, I like that they're all wearing my colors as well. That's neat. Unemployed going home. Why is everybody I look at unemployed? Okay, uh... We're continuing to pick up more from the football stadium. Dead people are continuing to be transported. Uh, can somebody please pick up the rest of the dead from the football stadium? There's more people who are injured. <laughs> what happened? The dead are waiting to be transported. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked. We've actually ran out of hearses. Well, you know what? We can always build some more. I really don't want to lose the football stadium. Could we have somebody pick up perhaps the dead people? Team Biscuits Cafe, Lafayette Residence, Summit Residence, the Franklin Residence. There was already people picking people up from them, unless more people have died over there. Please pick up the dead people from here. He's doing it. 60% of a dead person. There we go. We have kept our football stadium alive, unlike all the people who were dead at it. And we're going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.